Lobby Tools, legislative news and information systems, on the web at lobbytools.com. William Skrinski is a man on a mission. For the last five years, he's battled his insurance company over what sinkhole damage did to his Newport Ritchie home. This has been a nightmare that I would not wish upon my worst enemy. Skrinski was at the Capitol to fight proposed changes in insurance regulation that will make it even harder for many people to file sinkhole claims. If fraud is truly the issue here, go after the people committing fraud. Yeah. Not honest Floridians. Consumers did win a small victory in a Senate committee. For now, anyway, consumers won't have to pay for their lost contents out of pocket and then seek reimbursement. But consumer advocates say a series of insurance bills pose big problems for homeowners. Now these bills say Florida is for sale. And fortunately for the insurance industry, it has the money to buy it. Under the legislation, companies wouldn't even have to offer sinkhole insurance or pay a claim more than three years old. Rates could rise by up to 30 percent a year. The Florida Insurance Council says rates are going up anyway, whether the bills pass or not. The rates would be, will be a lot lower sometime soon with 408 passing and getting after public adjusters and getting after fraudulent and frivolous sinkhole claims. While consumers have at least temporarily won the reimbursement battle, the war is far from over. In Tallahassee, I'm Mike Vasilinda reporting.